In this video, I'm gonna share with you the seven AI tools I would use if I was starting from scratch today to build a seven-figure business in 2026, and the exact process to build a thriving, growing, profitable business too. And who am I to talk about this? Well, I have a seven-figure, growing, profitable SaaS business. So I've done that, I've done these steps, and I've spent the last 82 days recording and publishing a video every day about AI tools, methodologies, and how it's reframing everything we think we know about business. And I can say without a shadow of a doubt, the entrepreneurs and founders who lean into AI in 2026 are gonna be the ones that win big, and the ones that don't are gonna be the statistics and are gonna be replaced. I want you to win, I want you to build the business of your dreams, and this is exactly how I would do it. And as we dig into these tools, I just wanna share that they each have a very specific purpose and place that they're gonna sit within your business, okay? And the first of these is not a surprise, but is really instrumental, and that is Claude. Claude is gonna serve two purposes. It's one of the only ones that crosses over between kind of functional areas of your business. Claude is a fantastic kind of general purpose LLM and chat tool. You come in here, you can create projects, you have all these different functional kind of areas where Claude can be your thought partner, strategy partner, and execute a lot of content writing and things like that for you. Amazing tool. Claude also is going to be the place where you develop your product. Claude Code recently released in web, but also in mobile and on your desktop and Claude Code in the terminal gives anybody the ability to create world-class, very robust software applications, either for web, uh, like a SaaS or mobile. So you can do product development as a non-technical founder with Claude and Claude Code for 20 bucks a month. I'm on the pro plan. With Claude and Claude Code, it's all included together. 20 bucks a month gets you a world-class coder that lets you create incredible pieces of software, as well as world-class kind of thought and productivity partner for ops, strategy, marketing, content, and sales. Okay, so Claude is the first tool on here. If you have to have one general purpose LLM and kind of chat tool, it's the one I would choose. The next one is Whisperflow, which is actually a productivity tool more than anything, but what it's gonna do is just allow you to achieve, I don't know, 10 times what you can achieve without it. Whisperflow is a voice to text tool. I've mentioned it and used it on the channel here a lot. And what it does is you just speak into the microphone, it transcribes things real time onto your computer, uh, so you don't have to sit there typing, because typing is just really slow. Whisperflow is really cheap. I think if it's billed annually, it's like 80 bucks, super cheap. Downloads onto your computer, runs all the time. And I'll just give a quick demo here. I'll do a little note and I'll just hit option spacebar on my keyboard and I'll start talking and it'll transcribe real time. Hey, this is a real time demo of Whisperflow. I've been using this for about a year and it really is an exponential productivity increase in everything I do from giving commands to Claude and Claude code, to writing emails, to talking to my team, to replying to emails, I use it all day, every day, and it's really a game changer for me. Then I just hit command space again, and it transcribes it absolutely perfectly. So if you do nothing else from this video, take and get Whisperflow, you'll thank me, and just the amount of stuff you're able to get done with any application, whether it's an AI tool or not, uh, as, as you work, okay? So Whisperflow, highly recommended. The next one is HeyGen, and some of you may hate me for this, but there is absolutely a place for uh, generative video content in your marketing stack. And so this is my big marketing play here is if you're a solo founder trying to build a multi-million dollar business, you're going to need some leverage. We talked about, you know, Whisperflow and Claude and have some others coming, but what you need is a thing that can work without you all the time, 24 seven. And that's where we're going to get into agents in a little bit. But HeyGen is the tool that I think an agent could use to create video content. Did a video about HeyGen on the channel before, but what you can see here is you can create virtual versions of yourself for social media content. And so where would this fit in? Think about it for social media content. Think about it for explainer videos on your website. Think about it for long form YouTube videos. There's a YouTube video in the kind of AI news space that is entirely AI generated. And I think they have 300,000 subscribers. So while you may hate on this right now and think like, oh, hey, I need to be original and unique and authentic. I agree with that, but I don't think that's the only way to go. And so if you're talking AI leverage and really being a multi-million dollar business by, a, by yourself as a single founder, 
I think HeyGen or some kind of generative video is gonna be important in that stack, okay? All right, the next tool is Manus. So if you've watched any of my videos, you know I'm a big fanboy for Manus. It basically takes what happens with Claude code and the agentic abilities of a really strong LLM. They actually use Claude under the hood and puts it in the browser for me to play with. I use Manus every day for strategy, for marketing, for writing content. It's all the stuff that you would have to create a really specific project or GPT or Gemini gem for, but for things that I wanna do one off, I can just come in and say, hey, I'm thinking about doing this, what do you think? And it goes away and it does a bunch of research, gets a ton of context and delivers me a really, really, really good specific result. So while you could achieve the same thing with like Claude and Claude projects, if you're doing something over and over, that's probably how I would use it. But you've run a business before, you know, there's a ton of stuff that comes up that you've never seen before. And so you need a tool like Manus to say, hey, I don't really know what's going on here. Help me think through and solve this problem for one-off things, which are gonna happen all the time to you. So Manus, a second general purpose LLM tool, but very much an agentic tool. I did a whole video about how I created a thousand leads to do outbound uh, prospecting for in a business using Manus, and it was the only tool that could do this. It's really what makes it kind of rise to the top for me. Okay, the next one is where we get into AI agents and relevance, relevance AI, is a way to build and deploy AI agents for your work. So if you've seen things like Lindy or NADN or Make, really complicated, really technical, relevance takes a lot of that complexity off your plate. I'm gonna do a whole deep dive video. I'm actually using this in my business. I haven't uh, done a video on it yet, but this is my choice over places like NADN and Lindy because it's a really nice sweet spot of customization and ease of use, which I think is what we all need when it comes to AI agents because they're really powerful and they can be really, really, really difficult to build. But within relevance, you have different areas of the business, right? You can create agents for sales, agents for marketing, agents for customer support, agents for operations, agents for research, and they have a ton under the hood that you can build from scratch and have really custom dedicated agents that are bespoke for the unique needs of your business. I'm gonna talk about another one in just a second that is already built for you and I think is important for you to use, but relevance is kind of plugging those gaps where existing agents that are built specifically for a, a specific purpose uh, don't meet the needs that you have, right? So take and use an off the shelf product if you can, and then fill the gap with something like relevance when you define exactly what that specific thing you need to do in your business is, okay? The next one is Notion. You might be like, oh my gosh, Notion is not an AI tool. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it totally is. Notion is the ultimate kind of Swiss army knife of the internet these days. Uh, at my business, Castos, everything we do lives in Notion. 100% of our operations, documentation, uh, internal knowledge base lives in Notion. And now they have agents that live inside of Notion. So just imagine, you know, we always talk about context when it comes to AI. Imagine an agent knowing literally everything about your business and you can just talk to it and ask it things. And that's what Notion is. I think that's, as an aside, I think that's the reason Google, and I'm not <laughs> including any Google products here, surprisingly, but I think that's one of the reasons Google really could win the AI war, if you will, is they're gonna have context over everything that your business does if you're on Gmail and Docs and all that kind of stuff. Notion is that for us at my business, everything that we do lives in Notion and Notion Agent makes it really easy for us to extend and leverage the knowledge and the capabilities of a really powerful project management tool like this to write content, to run ops, to generate reports, to get data and insights on what's going on in our business. Everything flows into Notion and then we're using Notion Agents to automate activities and data around all of that. Okay, so Notion, maybe sleeping on it, Definitely don't. Okay, and the last one is intercom. And this comes because, you know, what's the saying is like, my business would be great if it wasn't for my customers. Don't say that, right? Your customers are amazing. My customers are amazing, love them every day. Uh, but doing customer support and doing customer success is hard and time consuming. And if you're gonna be a solo founder running a million dollar business, you can't be in there typing responses that you've typed a hundred times to customers. And so you need some kind of automated, AI driven chatbot and automated knowledge base to help customers solve their problems. Because what happens, I think when, when customers come to customer support and file a ticket or email you or something, like they've already failed at the thing they want to do. 
And so putting a thing like Intercom in their AI agent called Fin in front of that gives you a really good chance to say like, hey, I'm putting AI and I'm putting a thing in front of my customers when they might have that problem. It's 10 o'clock at night or they're in a different time zone or it's a really specific thing. An agent like this can come in, solve their problem so they never have to contact you. That's the thing. It's not like, hey, I'm gonna build a bot that responds to customer support inquiries. No, I'm gonna use a specific tool like Intercom. And Intercom is a monster, very successful company. And so I trust that they're building this the right way. Use a tool like this so you never get the customer support email. That's the whole thing is like, if you're gonna build a million dollar solo business, you gotta automate as much as you can. And this is a big part of that. Okay, so these are the seven tools I would use to build a million dollar business from scratch with AI. I've done it, we're a team, but I've done it, I've been there. I know what it takes. It's really hard, but it's 100% possible in the era of AI. And now that you have the tools and the framework for building that seven figure business into 2026, it's time to start building product because that's really the core of the offering that we'll bring to market. And check out this video over here on using Claude code to build incredible software and SaaS, even if you're not a developer.